Yep. Yeah. yeah, it's a zucchini, yellow flesh, um, it's a pepper, tomato, yeah. yeah. He called it hot, I don't know why he called it hot. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. No, my friend Mr. Pivo. I eat it, I eat it cook it. You cook a long Italian zucchini? Yeah. The Hubuza. Yeah, Hubuza. That is a really different taste than the regular. Yes, yes. I have a friend of mine, he, uh, he asked me for a capital, and I, I gave him and then he cooked it. Is this good? Uh, yeah, the thing from all you did, and then the chili is good. Can you talk about some of any challenges getting started with your business? Um, like any challenges with location? No, I haven't. Uh, when I got started, I, I know it took me a lot of years to decide I wanted to be a farmer. I was happy getting paid from another farmer. So the challenges, you know, like I said before, you go to the bank, hang you down, you know. So I, uh, I had tried and I had a pool for 10 years, who I, what I could do and, you know, who I could be, so they finally decided to, uh, you know, give me a chance. How many years did you work with the other farm? 26. Yeah. And how many years have you had your own? 22. Yeah. 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 That's a lot of years. <laughs> well, I came over here being a farmer, well, my mother used to live in the farm in Puerto Rico. Okay. I used to go work with her when I was seven years old. I came over here when I was 15. I had to go to school one year, because I was still under age. You know, and then uh, after I turned 16, I, I quit school and I went to work in the park. Now, now is the, are the same crops of Puerto Rico or different? Over there was coffee, uh, banana, plantain, sugar cane. Yeah, over here you have more tomato, you know, green, things you But you know, I, I've been here since 1969 and uh, I'm going to stay here. I don't think I'm going back. We've got plenty of land to work with here. Yeah. Puerto Rico, it's an island. You don't get all the land in the world. Well, it's, it's an island, it's, it's, it's too hot. I mean, 8 o'clock is 85 degrees, that's right here. Uh, the economy is down in the bottom. So the job is not hard to find. I mean, it's hard to find. Uh, I don't, I like it. You got four seasons. Over there, you got one of these. Every year, all year long. Yeah. And I made my, I got my kids over here. I got five kids. One is the business officer, one is the teacher, and one is she lived in Cape Town, and then two I got one in college and one hope to be a partner. You got me six days in school for five days. And if you want to get a fishing pole, you got to eat dirty. So you got water. Yes. You don't have to worry about water. Yes. So I don't think I'm going back to uh, Paris. I'm going to visit without water. Yes. Okay. Did you say you do most of work all the time? Yes. Uh, my, my wife, my wife and I were doing a hundred acres of wheat by ourselves for about six, seven years, and then I decided to buy more. And then she said, "Well, if you're going to buy more grapes, I'm not going to help you." I do the pay. I said, "Okay, you stay home and you do the paperwork, and you stay with the kids, and I, I do the work." So she quit working for me. That's the bookkeeper. You have trouble getting help? Yes. We had some uh, Mexican and the migration trouble. I had talked to Kathy Young, Schumer. We went to see lawyers, tried to get them to let them come back. I, I offered them that I would give them medical insurance, living quarter, um, and everything. And uh, after they got done, I got done talking to them, they told me, no matter what you give, you give them the two legal. 
so I can't get them back and I I wish I could get them back. I hear like a right hand. Well the four acres I took got too lazy except me. <laughs> you know uh, you can't get nobody that don't work the field anymore. You know, we pay ten, we pay ten, twelve dollars an hour and you can't get people to work. So that's that's what we gotta deal with. Well my husband and I used to work on a farm. Yep, and when plant goes on a strike, we want to make it great. Yeah, yeah. The neighbors are being done. You can't tell a lot of the kids today. Yep. Well, my, my son is going to be 16, and I offered him a job driving the tractor. I told him, I give you $10 an hour, I'm going to do driving the tractor. He hasn't worked one hour yet. Uh, when I was 15, I was already working full time. Kids are, kids are different now, you can't. Yeah. Well, since they passed that law that your children had to be 15 or 16 to work out a plan, that's what spoiled everything. I think so. And that and uh, when they start buying the text screen, those games, yeah, and the cell phones. Yeah. 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 I think when they start insisting people work for their welfare and things, they Yeah, well, that's what I mean. When I, when I was seven years old, my mother used to work me up, and I used to go work in the field with her. I learned how to work. Now they stay home and sleep till three o'clock, and they, we supply everything for them, so it's, it's different. You know? All they give them $20, $25 to be Yep. I used to get a quarter a day, I was happy. I worked, <laughs> I worked a quarter an hour. Yeah. Press. Five and nine. Was your family born here and raised here? Um, my kids, yes. Yes. All so, my five kids, yes. So they're used to the farm. United States. They used to the United States, but they're not used to the farm. Oh, they're not used to the farm? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, they all born over here and they all went to school five. All school went five kids. Yes. Uh, but none of them took up farming, huh? Unfortunately, no. Oh yeah. I, I did because I worked all my life on the farm. I've never been in a factory, not even in a tour. Yes. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I would like to go in a factory. Well, my, my parents were farmers and they were old enough to work in the factory. Do you work all winter? Oh, winter? Yes. Yeah. yeah, we don't work until the year. You know, we don't have to go on the winter. In the winter, we work for the Saturday night. We don't work. Hopefully, we don't have to work. Yeah. 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 Even if I only work two hours a day, so I got to go to the private school. Yeah. You've got to stay busy. Yeah. Even on my birthday, I want to work. I would want to ride the bill. Right after the light bulb, I would ride the bill. Wow. I came home from all happy. Now this month, this trip is going to be probably really young. You've got to go out and water it, right? Yeah, these guys are having everything. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Water tanks and get the water. Right now we're using water tanks to go water by yeah. 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 and contact. Try to keep water. Yeah. 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 Y